I recently was uh, able to participate in a program called an Albanian Day in Washington, D.C. on November 27th and November 28th, 2017. Um, that day is historic because we celebrated the 105th uh, anniversary of Albania on November 28th. So on November 27th, we were invited to the Albanian Embassy in Washington, D.C. for reception where we got to meet um, the ambassador, different diplomats, a few other students and their parents who were participating in the program with us on November 28th. We got to kind of go over the agenda and what was planned. Um, on November 28th, we started with the um, Atlantic Council, which is a think tank in Washington, D.C., which our primary focus there was to discuss NATO, the North Atlantic Treaty Organization, and its policies and its you know vision in Eastern Europe because NATO has a huge um, impact on every country and it's probably one of Albania's most um, prominent memberships to date. So we got to sit with the uh, head director that you know was kind of NATO's go-to at this think tank and got to discuss you know Albania's membership in NATO, um, how the United States helped Albania achieve the membership in NATO. The United States obviously has a huge impact um, on NATO and NATO decisions being you know the a global powerhouse in that type of organization and Albania having the privilege to be in that organization that was huge um, to be able to meet with the director and discuss what NATO does really in Eastern Europe and its peacekeeping ability that it has. The most important lesson that I probably received from this program was a lesson I learned from the US Department of State and their emphasis really was justice reform in Albania needs to happen for Albania to be a stable democracy, um, to be continue as a strong U.S. alliance and to integrate into the European Union. Um, so being able to really see the emphasis that the judicial system and our profession has on an entire democracy was just, it was unreal. I knew that it was a big deal for Albania to undergo you know, a justice reform and they needed independent and they needed ethical prosecutors and judges, but I didn't realize this is the top thing that they need to complete. They have the United States Department of State, you know, is heavily involved in this. They're helping, they're helping out Albania transform its judicial system. Uh, the U.S. Embassy in uh, Tirana, the capital of Albania, is also assisting, you know, other Western European countries. That's how big of a deal our, the, our um, industry and our, and the judicial system has on a democracy. And to see that and to hear that the, nothing else can happen until that gets done and then to hear the domino effect that a clean judicial system has on a democracy, on an economy, on tourism, on infrastructure was, you know, that's why you know, I went to law school.